Hi, I'm Andre. With the introduction of smart shopping, Google Shopping became the first campaign type to become almost entirely automated. While it's easier than ever to set up smart shopping campaign, many PPC managers are not sure how to optimize them. The primary optimization focus with smart shopping campaigns has shifted from optimizing bids to optimizing data the campaigns are exposed to. Therefore, optimization strategies for a smart shopping campaign fall under two categories, feed optimization and attempts to guide the machine. While the former ensures the baseline performance, the latter is what enables your campaign to scale successfully over time. Let's look at four optimization strategies for smart shopping campaigns. They are feed optimization, best practices for a new smart shopping campaign, ROAS goal options, and campaign segmentation. Now let's look closer at each one of them. Feed optimization is a large topic by itself. Today we'll look into two aspects, product attributes and diagnostic issues. Your product data feed is a file that is sent from your website to the Google Merchant Center containing all of your product information. Think of product feed as a massive Excel file containing information about all your products, where the rows describe each product and the columns contain all attributes of a particular product. There are dozens of attributes that you can add to describe your product. Some of them are required. You need to optimize your product attributes for two entities, for Google and for end user. Let's look at importance of optimizing product attributes for the end user. Look at this search result. I searched for computer LED monitor and I see five shopping ads. Which one do you think are most helpful? When you look for computer LED monitors, you want to know the product brand, probably you want to know the size and you also you want to know the type of a monitor. Out of these five ads, first two have all most popular attributes, while the next three do not have. I think these two products are more optimized for Google Shopping. There are several Google policies in place regarding shopping feed data that would impact your product quality score. The best place to look at them is Google Merchant Center Diagnostics tool. Try to fix all type of issues that you see in this tool. The rules for starting smart shopping campaigns are create only one smart shopping campaign. Unless you have groups with the different ROS goals for different products, then you should consider segmenting smart shopping campaigns based on roles. Set budget to highest daily amount in the last two weeks to give smart shopping room for training and for learning. Set bidding for max conversions. Don't use target ROS unless you really know your historical target ROS. And in this case, you set slightly uh, less aggressive target ROS. And very important, don't make any changes in the first 15 days or until the campaign stays in a learning phase. No budget changes, no target changes, no target in creative and so forth. If you don't set up a ROAS goal, Smart Shopping will optimize towards getting the most conversions within your budget. This is the best option for most advertisers. A month later, you can evaluate your performance and apply ROAS target. If there is a strict ROAS target or historical ROAS has been under 200%, then set your ROAS target for under the historical TROS for the last two weeks. If your feed has multiple products and product types and you have historical performance, then the best way is to segment your campaign by product types and then by ROS. Then set up a process to periodically update these products to apply different target ROS. There you have it. We looked into four optimization strategies for the smart shopping campaigns. Feed optimization, best practices for new campaigns, ROS goal options, and campaign segmentation. In the next video, we'll take a closer look at evaluating the smart shopping campaign performance during the first month. This is important when you need to understand if it's performing well or not. If this is of value to you, like, subscribe, and hit bell icon to get notified on the new videos. And let me know about your experience with smart shopping campaigns.
Thank you and have a great day.